Dario Brian was born on the 4th of February, 1972 in Bray, County Wicklow, Ireland. Hey Dara, is that a Vuvuzela in your pocket or are you just pleased to see me? He is 6 foot 5 tall and weighs exactly 80 kilograms. This brain box is most well known for his laser sharp wits and late night panel show mock the weekend appearances at the Apollo. But did you know this mathematical physics graduate is best friends with ex-pop star and D-Rimi was kid brain fox. He's got a beautiful singing voice just like his father who is a choir master. He's also a gamer, Dara definitely has a victory royale on his record. And obviously you've known my work for many years, you know it's pretty much wall to wall, sexy woo fest. <laughs> Which is ironic really, because when you have sex with me, I don't move at all. <laughs> His favorite word is defenestration, which means to throw someone out of the window. O'Brien's big break came when he turned 22. In an attempt to get his stand-up career going global he got into kids TV presenting. His bald shiny head and old fart uncle look was a huge success with the little kiddos. Ooh, yummy. Dario Brian hosts his own show called Go 8 Bit. It is a comedy panel show about video games. Each episode two teams compete, playing various games, such as Pokemon Go. Go Pokeball! Tekken. I'm a blow up a fat jab in this joint. Champions. The team leaders, Steve McNeil and Sam Pamphlet, are joined by celebrity guests. Some of these guests are godlike pros at competitive games and others suck. <laughs> Noobs. O'Brien, joined by resident gaming expert, Ellie Gibson judges the gamers and decides who wins. Wow. Did you know, the gender split of gamers is pretty equal no matter where you look. On handheld consoles, the split is male 55%, female 45%. On console, it's 60% male and 40% female. On mobile it's 55% female 45% male. Dar's all time favorite game is FIFA because he loves kicking balls. He used to love Bethesda's brilliant Skyrim, but then he took an arrow to the knee. In 2009 he was chosen to host the game British Academy Video Game Awards. In an interview, Dara said, I called for zombies to be added to more games. FIFA Zombie is a downloadable DLC. I even worked out a mechanic where you play zombies. If you get too close to the zombie you get turned into the zombie, but you can score quite easily against them. The key says, you got to finish your 90 minutes. You don't want corners. Because your players are close together and suddenly it's all zombies. <laughs> Aside from his funny comic chops, ethnic Catholic Dara the Bean is also a brainy mathematics whiz. The psych head of Clever Clogs even has a degree in theoretical physics and realetical math. Aged 42, O'Brien was able to score a 47 out of 60 on a GCSE higher maths paper in just 10 minutes, earning himself an A-star grade. Well done Dar. His wife is also a serious brain box, and currently works as a lurgeon in Sundon. Maybe she can give Dara some hair plugs whilst he naps and repair his tiny shiny bonds. Dara is a real fan of sports too and supports football team Arsenal in the English Premier League. He also adores Irish cricket and greyhound racing, going so far as to start a syndicate at his local dog track and running his beloved dog Snip Nua. Alongside regular appearances on panel shows Dara also finds time to educate the public. Hosting such intellectual clever boy programs as School of Hard Sums with Dave and Stargazing Live with Chum Brian Cox on the BBC 2. 
After all the partying, smashing and crashing of stargazing with Brian and Dari didn't even need a wish right now to receive a nomination for the 2017 BAFTA for Best Live Television Event. Unfortunately, they got caught up in the glitz, the glam of the fashion and all the pandemonium and the madness of the awards night, letting slip that some comments shown on the program were in fact planes. They had pretended that airplanes in the night sky were like shooting stars, and so did not win the award. Despite this the program is still well loved in the UK. Astronomer and North FC fanatic Dr. Gary Walker, a self-professed fan of the show, even named the newly discovered white giant star Dara O'Brien after the comedian. Dara is also very cultured and knows all about British history. His favorite event is the English gin craze where everyone went mad for gin after William the Orange was crowned into king, England was drinking 2.2 gallons of gin per person annually. If you enjoyed this video please subscribe and hit that like button for more wacky content. Next week we bring you, Maya Jama, the bestest radio DJ in the whole world.